Hi, I am Felipe Mejia Medina. Um, I'm an international consultant from Eco Consultancy. I've been a peer reviewer for the Journal of Medical Internet Research for quite some time. My focus is specifically on digital health, um, health uh, information systems, in polemics and qualitative research within this area of digital health. I also have done um, peer reviewing on governance and ethics because that's kind of my scope in research. I volunteer to peer review research because it really helps me to stay current and updated with the latest developments in my field. Um, it also allows me to learn continuously and expand my knowledge. That's really instrumental and useful for me. And I think it is also a way to give back to the community, uh, to the world in general and to science. Um, I think also that peer reviewing hones my critical thinking. Mm, it teaches me a lot and I learn from these authors and the way they approach their ideas and their research. So it also uh, gives me and improve my analytical skills. It provides me opportunities for professional development. And yeah, and I think it's, it's a good way to, to, to be part of the scientific community, to learn from this community, but also to, to give back uh, from the knowledge and experience that I've uh, come across and learned during all these years. Well, um, reviewing for the Journal of Medical Internet Research has really and truly enhanced my professional development, um, particularly because uh, then I learned from several experiences and from different perspectives within this huge field. Um, I'm not an expert on everything, but I have had some experience and I do dedicate my research on specific topics. So the, that has really been instrumental to improve my own research. So for example, um, there was the case of uh, analyzing the use of a chatbot in response to the COVID-19 pandemic. And this truly aligned very close to my current research, which is uh, generative AI within chatbots for global mental health in LM LMIC uh, countries such as mine, then that was really helpful to um, provide me ideas and new perspectives to approach my own research and methodologies. Um, that was really valuable and with really key insights on how to deploy this type of interventions. Um, so it really sharpened my abilities and my skills to assess in a critical way uh, my own uh, methodologies uh, and the way I was collecting data and my understanding in, in this specific case and in the field as a whole. What satisfaction and other benefits do I have from peer reviewing here? Uh, with this prestigious journal of medical internet research, well, a lot. Um, I feel I feel very much satisfied. Uh, I feel honored that I'm allowed to to provide my my point of view, my assessment, and my feedback on the field of digital health and and everything that falls under what this journal covers. So it's truly an honor and I'm very proud of, of doing peer reviewing. I think it is important for scientists to do it. I think it improves at the end the quality of science. Um, and I also learn a lot. I keep myself updated. I am able to be connected to cutting edge research uh, in my field. So that's absolutely important, both for uh, those sending these papers to be uh, assessed and finally published, but also it is very important for me because it helps me out to improve my own research, my own methodologies, how I approach 
my ideas and and it enhances my critical skills and my critical thinking, my reading abilities, then it's uh, it's truly amazing to to be able to do something like this. Sometimes it can be a bit uh, taxing because uh, some some papers can truly be uh, packed with information. Um, and then that's also a good way of pushing me into learning, into doing some research to provide a good feedback. And at the end, that's truly helpful for me and, and for the scientific community and for the society, uh, which is what we all want to do, to have a good impact on the world.